the shape of you Yo, what is going on everybody? And in this video, I will be showing you how to port forward your Minecraft server or any type of game server you'd like so that all of your friends from anywhere in the world can join and play with you on your server. And this is not too difficult. It it only depends on your um, Wi-Fi router or um, network connection to allow you to do this. So mine could be a little bit different than yours because if it is different you can go to your routers website and find more information about port forwarding from there but the one I'm going to be using is called Netgear so I now to get it you're going to type in your IP address and um, to get it you need to I believe is open up command prompt so uh, I just need to look for it you can I'm on Windows 8 right here but you can go to CMD type it in CMD and then this command prompt will show up then what you want to do from here is type in IP config and type enter no spaces or capital letters, no underscores, just type in ipconfig and you will get this. You are going to need to look for, let's see if I can find it here, just maybe scroll up a bit, uh, where is it, uh, right here, wireless LAN adapter, says it right up here. So the default gateway, I'm going to type in my default gateway, so it is 172.16.0.1 so um 172.16.0.1 and then you are going to type in your password and username it's all different and depends on your router but the I'm just going to put in the default values for these so it's just that username is admin password is password if you type in that into your router you will not be hacking into my thing because it's the way it's set up so I'm going to log in and from here this is the using the Netgear Genie setup. It really depends on your router that will um, be the one that will work for you. So you can go to your router's website and find out more information about port forwarding from your computer. But this is mine, so I'm going to click on Advanced at the top right here. Going down on this left panel right here, click on Advanced Setup and down here port forwarding slash port triggering click on that and as you can see I already have two servers right here one is my minecraft pocket edition server and this one right here at the bottom is my minecraft PC server and they both have different ports my pocket edition server is 19132 and my PC server is 25565. Now I'm going to actually go ahead and just delete one of them so that I can show you how to create it. So now that that's done, I'm going to create a new one. So down here at the bottom, I'm going to click Add Custom Service. And from here, the service name right here at the top. I'm going to put it Minecraft Server. And the protocol is going to be both TCP slash UDP. Then for the port, external port range, it's going to be this is um I'm rec I'm recreating my a Minecraft PC server, so I'm going to use my port 255 
six five. So depending on what game you're using, you can look up the game port for that. Since this is a Minecraft server, I'm going to use that. Then check mark right here uses same port range for internal port. So yeah, just check that and it will go there. Now the IP address of your computer, you are going to go right here, and you are going to need to look for where it says IPv4 address. So mine is 172.16.0.7, right there. So let's see here. What was it, 0 0.7? So it is this one right here, so I'm going to check that. And then it should be good, so I am going to click Apply. So that should be working now. I'm going to... I am going to start up my server and see if I can join it. So let me get all these files set up and I will be back as soon as it's all set up. Alrighty, I am back with my Minecraft open right here. So to join your servers, you're just going to select multiplayer. And there we go. I already have my server at the top. I'm actually going to delete it so I can show you how to join it. Because when it says scanning for games on your local network, it seems to be broken. So it's not working. So I'm going to click right here, direct connect. And you're going to need to type in the server address, so the IP, or actually you can just type, you can easily type local host, just like that, to be able to join, or you can type in the IP. Now to get your IP, you go back up to here, go to Google, search, and it's very, very easy. All you have to do is um, type in what's my IP and it will show up. So this is the public IP right there that you can use to join your server. I don't know what just happened. Here we go. This is the IP that you use to join your server. But if you want Giving this IP away to total strangers is a little risky, and I have taken the risk to show you. But what you can do is I will save it for my next video of how to change the IP into being able to join something like what I'm going to show you now. My S um, server IP is sw.bsg.us.to. I will show you how to do that in my next video, unless you already figured out how to do it. I don't care, I'm still going to make that video. Now, if you did end up changing the port, um, the port that you port forwarded has to be the same as um, the port that's listed in the settings or it won't work. But if you do if you do decide to run your server on a different port, just put a um, colon and then the port. So 25565, you can just do that if you want. And then click join server. And then you will be logging in and I hope I don't lag so bad that it crashes the screen recording and I have to start all over again so hope that doesn't happen it's already taken forever and now my minecraft is not responding um, it's lagging so bad this is the part of the spawn that we already started building um, yeah, how about if I stop recording right now before this does something. So, anyways, that is how you port forward your server. And in the next video, I will show you how to get that cool IP for your server that you can tell your friends and they can join from anywhere on the world. 
perhaps Australia or or even New Zealand I don't care but anyways drop a like on this video if you enjoyed and be sure to subscribe and I will catch you in the next video peace I'm in love with the shape of you